Mannheim. Today is Tuesday, October 15th, and today's a Cycle C Day. And it is also National Grouch Day. How many holidays are there? Well, it sounds like somebody's already celebrating it. <laughs> yeah, so what? I hate waking up early, and it's early, and I just feel like being in a grumpy mood today. Well, this grouch and all our other grouches out there, today is your day. Okay, I have a really funny joke today. This one better be funny. <laughs> oh, it is. What time do ducks wake up? Uh, seven o'clock. At the quack of dawn. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. Uh, all right, guys, let's uh, let's check out the core values for today's courage quote. Welcome back, Mannheim. Our big idea is courage. In books and movies, the hero usually has to show some courage to make it through the challenge. What is your favorite fictional character that shows courage? How can you be like that character this month? Take a look at today's Courage video. Hey kids, I'm Lawson, and if you can't tell, it's really wet outside. Like, row, row, row your boat wet. Like, it's raining cats and dogs. In fact, on my way over here, I almost stepped in a poodle. Get it? Poodle? Puddle? Because it's funny, right? Because it's a poodle and it's a puddle. Anyways, why do we say that? Raining cats and dogs. Like, can you imagine? You have a beagle falling out of the sky over here and cats dropping out of the sky over here and it'd just be a bunch of meow, 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 and woo, 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 and, and meow, meow, and just be a tangled jumble of furs and teeth and claws and everything's flying. It's just one big... Where was I? Anyways, I just heard this rockin' story from my little cousin about one wet dog and a set of really spooky, scary, dark basement stairs. So, my cousin Merritt is super excited because her mom finally let her stay home alone instead of going to the grocery store for like the 289th time that week. So she's like, Mom, don't worry, I'm just gonna sit here and do my homework. And maybe have a cookie. Or seven. And her mom's like, that's fine, just as long as you never put the phone down, ever! So you can call me anytime. So her mom leaves and she starts doing her fractions and we all know how those go. She's like, if I take three oatmeal raisin cookies and break them up into four groups and then divide them into two parts... And so she just eats a chocolate chip cookie instead. And suddenly, out of nowhere, a crack of thunder hits! Ah! And there it's like, I'm not scared. That didn't scare me at all. But then it starts to rain. Hard. Her dog, Astro, is left out in the yard, and he starts getting scared like a three-year-old in the rain, yelling, Help! Help! So Merritt runs through the window, and she's like, I'll save you, Astro! But the only way to let him in through the backyard is to go down the really creepy basement stairs. So she looks down those stairs, and all she sees are these spider eyes staring back at her. So she flips on the light, and then BAM! The power goes out! But Astro's still in the back, yelling, help, help. So Merritt takes a deep breath, and she runs as fast as she can down the stairs, through the basement, howling just like Astro the whole time. Oh! Oh! And she gets in, she yanks open the door, and Astro shakes. Whoa, that's a hairy dog. What? I'm just saying. Anyways, Merritt's mom is super proud of her for facing the dark side and for showing one super cool thing, courage, which is being brave enough to do what you should do even when you're afraid. What smells like wet dog? Daniel, did you forget to shower again? Oh wait, that's me. Well, this is embarrassing. I need a cookie. See you guys next time. Our word of the week is aware. Hmm. That's a good word. For instance, some of our students need to be aware of where they are walking in the hallways. <laughs> yes, they do. That's a great example. Aware means to be alert or realize. Mm -hmm. And we encourage you to use this word today in your speech and in your writing all week. Good idea.
Today begins our first day of parent visitation. Many of you have a parent coming today or later this week. And we need to show them how we are at Mannheim Stars in the classroom and while we are learning. All right, happy birthday to Asia in Miss Wilson's class. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. And finally for lunch today, we have choice one, pizza burger, and choice two, the tuna sandwich. As always, Mannheim, remember to be a star today. Strive to do your best. Take responsibility for your actions. Always be safe and respect people and property. Have a wonderful day, Mannheim.